Ecologist Jeffrey Parker has been closely watching these trees in Maryland grow for more than two decades. This winter, he came up with some startling findings. The old forests were growing faster, the intermediate aged forests are growing faster, and even the young ones. It's as though we gave steroids to a whole population of humans, and they're all growing faster individually than you would expect from the normal growth trend. Poplars, oaks, hickory, every single tree of every kind found in this centuries-old forest is on a fast track. It's as if you were adding another medium-sized tree to the forest every year. Parker says this is a direct result of climate change. In the last century, world temperatures have gone up three-tenths of a degree. In this region, the concentration of CO2 in the air is up 13 percent from 20 years ago, and the growing season is a week longer than it used to be. When you increase the CO2 concentration around a plant, it grows faster. And when you raise the temperature around a plant up until some point, it grows faster. And if you give a plant longer to grow, well, it'll grow longer as well. Trees are some of the biggest consumers of CO2. So perhaps this increased growth that scientists are documenting could have a positive effect on the air quality in the area. But it's not that simple. It's probably a good thing that atmospheric CO2 is being kept from rising faster. But it may be a bad thing if, if um, the quality of wood that's produced with this extra growth is poor. In the meantime, Parker and his team will continue methodically measuring their trees every two years. But scientists don't expect the trees to sustain their accelerated pace, since the quantities of other substances essential to their development, soil and water for example, haven't changed.